Amanda Bynes is further clarifying previous claims she made about fiancé Paul Michael, doubling down on her belief that he relapsed on crack cocaine, despite confirming his most recent drug test came back clean. To clarify, I said what I said about Paul relapsing because he did, Bynes, 36, shared via Instagram Friday night alongside a photo of their engagement rings. I don't know when he got clean and because of the disturbing porn he was watching, I assumed he must be on drugs now. Also Paul did vandalize his mom's home two weeks ago. His brother Mark called the cops on him but Paul left before they got there, she went on. When I saw the mom and son porn on Paul's phone, I got upset and kicked him out. When he left I was worried he would vandalize my home because he still had the keys. That's why I called the police. At any rate, I shouldn't have said he's currently using, because he's been sober for two weeks. Also, he told me he searched MILFs and the other content auto-filled the search engine. Bynes claimed in a multi-part Instagram story early Thursday that Michael, stopped taking his medications and was using drugs in secret. Paul told me that he stopped taking his medications. I looked at his phone and he was looking at mom and son porn. He vandalized his mom's home, she told her followers at the time. He broke all of her pictures and put salmon under her bed, she continued. His behavior's alarming, and I'm afraid of what he'll do. Hours later, she clarified the porn confusion and shared that, I went to CVS, bought a drug test. Paul tested clean. Paul's clean. Bynes' conservatorship was terminated in March after nearly nine years, with her lawyer sharing at the time that the star was gearing up for her future with Michael, whom she met while in Alcoholics Anonymous. She's doing very well and looking forward to moving in her property with, fiancé, Paul, David Desquibias told People. They're actively searching for furniture and she's excited about all of it.